Now, semen analysis is which is done on sperms and it is the first line with an abstinence period of 3 days as in the gap between the last ejaculate should not be less than 3 days and not more than 7 days. Less than 3 days there is a chance that we may get lesser number of sperms in the uh, semen that we collect or more than 7 days could mean that the motility could come down uh, and uh, we could be giving a compromised report. So, it should be after 3 days and before 7 days. Now, if the semen analysis report has revealed that the count is lesser than what it should be according to the World Health Organization which is the concentration 15 million per ml and if the motility is less than 40% which is to say that the progressive and the non-progressive together are 40% uh, in the report and the morphology at least 4% are normal in the sample. If they do not adhere to this standard given to us by the WHO guidelines, then it is supposed to be an abnormal semen analysis report.